Today we are going to discuss vortexes. Vortexes are a direction of energy flow. A simple wire has a positive and negative into it. This is actually what helps to power the tensor rings. But just to show you, we're going to use a pendulum and we're going to ask for it to show us the direction of spin that comes out of the end of this wire. What is our direction of spin that comes out of this wire, please? A clockwise spin. And again, this side, direction of spin of the energy as it comes out of this wire is a counterclockwise spin. Now then, as far as vortexes go, they are a matter of perception on your clockwise and your counterclockwise spins. So, this side over here, if this side, what do we say, it spins at a clockwise spin? Yep, okay, so this side over here spins at a clockwise spin, and that means that the energy is going out. So this side, the energy is going out this way. This side is a counterclockwise spin, and as we look at it, it would be the left-hand spin. This draws energy in. So, energy is flowing into the wire this end, flows out this end. With a vortex, there is always two sides to a vortex. There's energy that comes in and energy that goes out. Energy can also be information. So, let's take a look at this guy here. This little symbol is the um, U.S. Treasury seal. So, we have a U.S. Treasury seal here on a U.S. dollar bill. Now then, again, with the way that a vortex flows, the vortex is simply energy that flows, and as it flows outwards, it'll flow in a clockwise spin. What direction is that energy flowing? It is in a right-hand fashion. It is the direction that the energy is flowing out of the seal. Okay, and again, a clockwise direction is energy comes out. So, there's energy coming out of this seal. You can look on the back of this bill, and there's no place for the other side of this vortex. A vortex has to have two sides. A vortex is nothing more than a directional flow of energy. Energy can contain information. That is what most energy fields do. So, if this thing is sending information out by a vortex of energy, the other side where the information and energy is going into is not on the back side of the bill. This is a tensor ring. It's called the money changer. So with the tensor ring, you simply take your bill and you would run your bill through this ring. Or you can even set it right on top of there. So the tensor rings, they actually create a vortex of their own. So anything that goes within the tensor ring here is transmuted. We're also using our intentions to change the direction of the spin on this vortex. As we have set the ring there, or you can pass it through your bill, then we come back with the pendulum again and we ask for a direction of the vortex and it changes to a counterclockwise fashion. When a vortex is in a counterclockwise fashion, the energy is actually going in now. So what we do with the energy that is going into this U.S. Federal Treasury seal is we send it unconditional love and light and all their cosmic and earthly rays of light. We just send unconditional love without judgment. You know, that's the way that we make our changes. We don't fight against things. We don't go against. We don't do anything in a negative fashion. We use love and light to transmute the energy, to transmute the information. So as energy is now going into, it is coming out the other side. So we're just sending unconditional love and light to transmute 
anything to assist to help make the changes. So, again, a vortex, as you are looking from the vortex point, and is going out in a positive, in a right hand spin, energy going out. If you are the vortex, and you are looking out, and the energy is going in a clockwise spin, or in a counterclockwise spin, that means energy is being drawn in. So now then, we are drawing energy in instead of energy out of the symbol. We did it with a tensor ring. You can use tools. These tools are boosters of intention. Or, you don't even need this ring. You can just use your intention and say, hey, we're making this little vortex of energy spin in a different direction so that it'll take love and light through it. And that is the way to energetically work with money. Have fun. Do it at banks. Do it for every bill that you have. Do it without judgment. Do it without fear. This is a time to be grateful. This is a time to make changes through the heart. Have fun.